Hi guys, so the first baby that I want to reintroduce to y'all is Mr. Milo Reed and he is the Luciano by Cassie Brace sculpt and he was reborn by Sweet Mommy Nest on Instagram. He actually is the giveaway baby that I won off of Instagram and I am super super proud of him. I think he is a gorgeous gorgeous boy and I just actually did a changing video with him with you guys and um, a little accident happened with my changing table on the move here and they broke off one of the feet of the changing table so I, this was the ver first video I had tried with um, changing him and it just wobbled everywhere so we have a guy coming out, I believe September 6th, to assess the damages from uh, the move because we had a few things that got damaged. And hopefully, not long after that, I'll have a replacement and it can't come soon enough because the lighting on that side of the room where the changing table is, is absolutely perfect. It's okay here um, in the bed, but... It's a little bit dark, but on that side, it's just the perfect. You know how I'm always about natural lighting? Well, it's there. It's just a shame I can't do a video there yet, but life goes on, right? So, anyways, here's Mr. Milo, and he is a handsome, handsome boy. And he is wearing a thrifted outfit that I got while we were living in Fort Worth in temporary housing and I think he looks so super sweet but he's a gorgeous baby I love him to pieces he's a nice size and he is perfectly perfectly weighted so this is the reintroduction for Mr. Milo and now I'm going to get down to business with Miss Everly. Um, she's my silicone baby. And I have decided after much contemplation to pierce her ears. I figure, you know what, she's my baby and I always have my girl's ears pierced. So yes, she's silicone, but I even have my mini silicone's ears pierced. And um, I love it. So we're just going to go ahead and pierce her ears. So let me get her ready. Okay, so I have Miss Everly here. And I couldn't quite decide whether to use little faux diamonds or pearls. And quite honestly, um, if you look at my girls, I am more inclined to go towards the pearls. And so I don't know if those are coming in clear. So I'm going to use itty bitty little pearls on her ears. I just, I held them up to her and I think with her skin tone and all that, that that would be the best choice. So I am, this is going to be interesting because she is wobbly and we're going to go ahead and just turn her on her right side first. And, let me set these earrings somewhere. There's one of them. Let's see. I'll stick it in the blanket. And we're going to go ahead and pierce her ears. So, I'm just going to place it where I want it. Just like that. Actually... I'm concentrating guys so if I get quiet this takes a lot of concentration because I don't want to screw it up that's for sure so we got one ear pierced let's show y'all she is so heavy like that they look so pretty and they are the smallest size now I'm gonna eyeball the evenness I gotta have her on her back 
Oh, she looks so cute with them pierced. And I'm just going to gauge it by lining it up. Let's see. About right. Let's see. Right there. Oops. Just like that, and I think we got them actually perfect. I'm going to pick her up and look at them really close. Let me see. Here's one. Oops. And there's two. I would say they are just about even. Her left ear is actually staring at her. Is a little bit lower than the right ear. I don't know if y'all can see that. But her hair is so very soft. I need to figure something out because it is so soft. It's like down feathers. That it, it kind of mats up a little bit. And I don't really know how to prevent that. So, anyways, guys, Miss Everly finally has her ears pierced, and we got to reintroduce Mr. Milo, and um, I'm just going to continue being a busy bee around this house and getting things cleaned up. I hope y'all have a wonderful day, and thanks for watching. We'll talk soon. Love you guys, and take care. Bye-bye.